beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Uh, the sun is going down in London. I'm currently on the rooftops of the Printworks in, in London where they produce 1.2 million daily mails every single day. Uh, it's now like beer festivals and it's a, kind of like raves and they produce Batman films here and all sorts of other amazing, amazing things have gone on in this building. It feels such a pleasure to have this view behind me. There is, I suppose you can say London. Canary Wharf is over the other side, if I can just flip this, flip this around here. There, I'm not sure if you can make out Canary Wharf behind us, it's kind of like there. And the shard is kind of over there. But I want to get this view. I want that view, that's, that's the view I want. Um, unbelievable, unbelievable. So, um, I'm going to be doing an overtone Stouter, 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 Stouter. Um, it's a 6% ABV beer in a 440 milliliter can. Um, it's an oatmeal stout. Without further ado, let's get this beer out into a glass and see what we get. I'm so excited for this beer review. Um, I think in a moment I might be joined by Paul from Paul's Beer Reviews as well, which... Here he is. There's pebbles, there's pebbles on the roof of the, um, look at that for a shot, Paul. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that for a shot. Isn't that beautiful? I've, I've got the perfect shot here. Um, what are you drinking? What have you got? Well, I'll have a bit. I, I'm not going to use it all, so mm. you get some, just in case John comes over. we got John from Lord's Brewing Company as well. Um, Ooh, such a privilege, mate. Honestly, such an absolute privilege to, to be here today. Um, of course, please check out Paul from Paul's Beer Reviews. Um, I'm not going to call him another beer channel. I'm going to call him a mate. Do you mind me calling you a mate? Oh, I love that. That would be an honour. Rather, an rather than check out Paul's Beer Reviews because he's a channel, I'd like you to check out Paul's Beer Reviews because he's a mate. He's a, he's a mate. watching him because he's a good lad. <laughs> <laughs> so, back to the beer. We've got a 6% ABV. Uh, we got a, I got a two-finger tan-coloured head. Uh, nice levels of carbonation, um, jet black oatmeal stuff really. Overtone, absolutely kicking it. They are. Absolutely kicking it at the moment. Um, I couldn't think of a better place to do a beer review for, for Overtone Brewing Company's beers. We look a little dark, but you know, who cares when you've got a view like it's, that it's behind us? Well, the sun's setting behind we, we, us. We've got a storm brewing, haven't we? Over yeah, that, over yeah, yeah. Towards the it's north. Definitely, there, it's, so definitely it's, uh... it's definitely coming. It's definitely coming. Aroma. Uh, lots of chocolate malt, lots of roasted malt. Definitely an oatmeal stout, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So there's no mistake. Loads of oatiness, as Paul's just mentioned. Yeah. I'm picking up a little bit of fig and prune. Yeah, maybe dark fruit. maybe some dark fruits yeah, as well coming through. coming through. Yeah. Should we? Should we? Um, what would you call it? Dig in, or what do you call it? Let's get stuck. Let's in. get Let's stuck get in. in. Cheers, everyone. Cheers. 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 Mate. What a pleasure. Well, oh my goodness me. Ooh, good levels of carbonation no on that one, isn't there? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just like, I'm in the well, moment. There's no, there's not a bit of wind. No. There's not a bit of wind. There's not like, despite, oh man. Despite all that cloud rolling over, it's calm. It's really you calm up here. You can just see the cloud. I'm behind you, behind you. I mean, let, let, let's show you guys. Let's show you guys. I know it's, this is supposed to be a beer review, but look how, look how dark that is. Look at that. That's coming. That's coming there. Um, we got Canary North, we've got our business district right behind us. Incredible, incredible backdrop. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. But yeah, um, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to concentrate here. Back to the beer. My, my usual kind of suspects, chocolate, coffee, caramel, I say that in, in yeah. most of my beer reviews. Um, you get the roasted malt. It's a bit like if you go for a, a, a coffee you get that kind of beautiful. I like. I like a latte pie. I don't yeah, know about you. Yeah, I'm very much getting that. It's got yeah. a, lot, a lot of roasted malts. It's like you're drinking a cafe latte. Yeah. A nice yeah. milky coffee with a bit of caramel added yeah, to it. Yeah. It's got a nice bit of kick at the back end as Absolutely well. Absolutely fantastic. The mouth is lovely. Fantastic. Isn't it? Yeah. Really, really smooth. Glides down. And it's well carbonated. I wasn't expecting the carbonation. I think no. That, that bit no. of carbonation really helps throw that malty, that chocolatiness around. I think really chocolatey, biscuity, good body, as you just mentioned. A mm. little bit of carbonation. Just had a drop of rain on my face. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. We're going to get this beer review done. Stouter.
Overtone have had a fantastic festival, haven't they? They really have. They've had a fantastic festival. We're going to um, try and call John. Um, John, you're going to come and taste this beer. He, 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 he's, we're going to get John from Lords in as well. Um, oh. Hell of a guy. But whilst we're here drinking this amazing beer, that was too drinkable. <laughs> I want to say a massive thank you to Tommy. Tommy for getting up here. Yeah. And, and, Holly the, and, and well. the lovely lady Holly. Yeah. The, the lovely lady Holly. Holly for giving us that. Um, but unbelievable. I, I do, do you know what? John. I think I think John's okay. I think John's busy recording over there. Yeah. I think I think John's we've, okay. We've got such a good location. It'd be silly not to do some recording. So yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll do it. we'll do our own review over here. Yeah. I wanted John from Lord. We we'll give John from Lords a shout out. Yep. Um. He's, he's got us down here this weekend. <clears throat> it's been fantastic. Unbelievable. Here's the rain, mate. It's just starting to drip now. Here's the rain. I'm in such awe. I, I, I never get to go to London. I never go to these big cities. Um, well, I do, but, but lockdown's happened as well, and COVID has happened, haven't it? But it's like, this is the first time we've all been together and had a beer together. So and to is, do uh, it here, yep. to do it here, to do it like, bang, you're not in your, you're not in your kitchen anymore. Yeah, you're back, back out garden, again. Because I kind of got used to this a little bit. If, I, if I'm not, if I'm being a bit... I was going to, before lockdown, I was going to like Denmark, I was going to Sweden, I was going to all these amazing places. And then all of a sudden, 18 months, you're not allowed to go anywhere. Mm. And then when you when you get to go back to look at that, I mean, I cannot get, it's a hell of a view, isn't it? Absolutely, really? absolutely terrific, terrific. It really is. Um, Paul. It makes the beer taste better. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> absolutely. It makes the beer taste better. Radim, coming Radim. in on this, um, we have an oatmeal stout. Oatmeal stout, I like this, 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 one of my favorite styles. Oatmeal, oatmeal stout, stout. overtone, um, quick, quick kind of like shout out to these guys. They're based in Glasgow in Scotland. Um, they've been going for about three years. <laughs> they started sending me their beers when they were a very small company. And I was shouting. I was like, this company is going to do amazing, amazing things. And now they, they're at that level where they're doing like, kind of like, you know, like Verdant. And they're doing like Cloudwater. They, 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 right. They're the Scottish, so the, the, the Scottish the, the, Cloudwater. That the, 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 the middle, middle craft beer. Yeah, yeah. But shouting about it very early. Can you, uh, Absolutely. yeah. In your glass. <laughs> There's a nice chocolate that's going through, obviously. Redeem is uh, Budweiser, Budva, from the Czech Republic. Not the American one. No, the original one. <laughs> the real one. The real one. <laughs> it's very mellow. Yep. Probably striking uh, dark chocolate. Yeah. No milk in it, so probably there's no, no lactose or anything like I'm that. Happy yeah. I'm happy with that though. I'm happy. I don't me, like me, adjuncts. Me too, me too, because... I don't like adjuncts. It, uh, you know, if you if you produce a beer, yeah, you want to produce it the classic, the, the classic way. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, the beer way, yeah. And uh, the more things you put in it, it's like, it just shows that, that the skill is not there, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So like the more adjuncts you throw in there, it's just like, it shows that I'll leave it with everyone to, to, to decide about that. But I think if you brew a raw stout, then... then this, is, this is just like... A, just stout. You know, if I, if I had to describe it like five words, this is like uh, getting a chocolate punch in the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's absolutely yeah. wonderful. But with roasted malt. But not, not with like cocoa or, but, or chocolate uh, the, the, or... The, the, the yeah. roasted malt actually doesn't, doesn't strike through like... Uh, you'll get like in, in Guinness, for example. Yeah, 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 yeah. This one is very rounded, very milky, very... Even milky without lactose, pretty much there must be some oats. I haven't read the oh there's I haven't read it properly, but incredible. Absolutely incredible. Incredible. You know one thing I like, uh, I really like to pair oatmeal stout with a space eye whiskey. Yeah, yeah. I lived Ooh. in Scotland for three years Ooh. and I'm, I'm a whiskey lover, a scotch lover. Right. Yeah. So definitely would pair this one with like some sherry cask nose whiskey. So if the Scott. brewers of, from Scotland in Overton are watching this, they're probably like <laughs> nodding, nodding their head going, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we it's, get it's, that too, we get that too. It's absolutely wonderful. Um, yeah. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Uh, Redeem, can I ask you to rate that out of 10? For me, it's a nine, I think nine out of 10. Uh, so Paul as well. Paul's going eight out of 10. How many out of 10? Uh, in a stout category. Yeah. Yeah. 6%. I, would, I would go. 6%. Oatmeal. I will give it a little bit more body. I think it's a little bit watery at the end. Yeah. For my personal taste. Mm -hmm. But you can fill it up with the whiskey. Uh, 
I would go with like eight and a half. Yo, so we're in between. <laughs> so John, we, we we got three different scores now. So John is needing to give the, coming in and give the final score on this so beer. Right. John from Lord's Brewing oh, Company. Oh yeah. I was. I'm yeah, really you need to hand that yeah, over. To, yeah, that hand that over to. So, come on. It's a dribble. I'm sorry. It's a dribble. I love a dribble. With the candle. Over here. Ah, yeah. There you go. I tried. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Cheers. So. Uh, so we got a nine, we got an eight point five, we got an eight. Wow! So we need you to don't define me, it. Don't need tell to define me what I'm it. drinking. No, I won't. <laughs> it's like very roasted, well balanced. Mm -hmm. Lovely, isn't it? Um, yeah, yeah. Oh, the finish is brilliant. Yeah. Is it a stout or a porter? It's a it's a, an oatmeal stout. Oatmeal, oatmeal right, stout. Right, yeah. that makes a load of sense. Six percent. Yeah, roasted. Um, oh, it's, it's really what ABV? It's a strong six, ABV. Six percent. Is that six? It mm. feels like it's stronger. Is it's it? got like a wood. I'm getting like a wood out mm. of it. So what do you reckon? We got an eight, an eight point five, and a nine. You're going to split this in terms of. What, what? I could drink that. That's a proper winter beer. Mm. Sat in a, a pub with a, an open fire. With a scotch. With it, with it. Yeah. With a scotch, and yeah. you're drinking beer as well. With, with a That's a flipping check for you. That's yeah. the checks for you. <laughs> scotch and a beer. Um, oh wow! I love the finish. It's um, yeah. I could drink that. I could drink that. That's that's a solid eight. Eight. Who said eight? Paul's one. That's a solid. Paul's <laughs> one. Paul's one the day. Thanks for watching. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer. Well, one second. One second. I'm just going to do this and show you. There's the beer festival. There's the beer festival down there. Um, thanks for watching. Please comment. Please subscribe. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.